Oh, hey. Oh, boy. Let's get started with part three of the three-part act, Flag Rally. And I'm not really looking forward to this because this is this is uh, essentially capture the flag and then once you get the flags you gotta go take them to a specific place on the map and so I don't know how many flags are running around but there's probably uh, up to uh, probably eight maybe nine or ten flags and I hate the flags if you had noticed, they're all running around, they all have legs, and they can, they s supposedly have some kind of a brain, so they can see you and dodge you, and it, it's just awful, and I'm really rusty, I haven't done this, this specific flag rally in general in uh, a few months, at least, maybe six months to a year, so but I'm doing all right. And so, okay, so, so you just saw there, when you get a flag, or two, or three, or even four, four is how many you want to get. And so when you have a flag or more, if you get hit by like a punch, you, lo you lose one flag, which sucks. So then if you have two flags, somebody already has four flags, what the hell? Okay, good. How did you? How did I know? Because the while I'm playing, there's there's a noise that gets made when somebody has four flags. I uh, don't really know how to describe it, but that I can I if you hear a noise and you can see uh, whoever has four flags, they their head is flashing around. Uh, forget it, I can't describe it very well, but, so, getting four flags is hard enough, and then getting them safely to the specific, you know, circular uh, flagpole area is even harder, you know, to get a clear shot, and, you know, besides every other character going for them, sometimes, like on this one, there's a couple more obstacles to go through once you have four flags. And I'll get to that later. Oh, so you know, everybody's going for four flags, so, so therefore, if, even if you don't have a flag and you're about to get one, uh, yeah, somebody will just, will just kill you out of nowhere. If you had noticed, I'm not doing that well, because I'm a bit rusty here. And I get to kill sheep. That's amazing. I hate when the flags go way down there. Then I do something good and kill Whack, who had at least two flags. Out of nowhere, Cinder just comes in and kills me for no apparent reason. I sometimes have to remind myself that even though I'm going after flags, this is not a smack attack. Killing people doesn't matter. I mean, unless you're trying to get their flags, in which case it does matter. But then, if you saw over there, that was where you have to take the flags once you have four of them. Damn it. Seriously, this is getting pretty bullshitty. I'm. I don't usually. Well, four minutes, I mean. Can take up to. Uh, oh, oh! You don't even want to know. Last time I was, last time I did this, I was playing co-op with my friend. I was trying to help him win, so so I wasn't really trying. I'm trying to help him win. Oh, I got three. That's that's a good shortcut, by the way. Go through that tunnel. You pop out the other side. Comes in handy for an escape route. But, so... Oh god, always gets me... Hey, a vacuum! I haven't even talked about the vacuum. This is where the vacuum comes in. The most handy ever. 
God damn it, Bruno. Seriously. Fucking foul mouth. God. But, yeah, okay, so you probably notice the vacuum. If you suck up somebody who has flags, you will get their flags. Which is great. But then bad if somebody does it to you, obviously. And that's why the vacuum is most handy here during the flag rally events. And what I was trying to get to earlier, the last time I played flag rally on this level, Wild Woolly West, to help my friend win, I don't just it's kind of what I'm doing. I've since I've beaten this game before, when every time every time he comes over, um, he wants to beat this game. It's happening very slowly. God, freaky fuck! I'll show you what ruin it means. Ah, sorry. <laughs> Drinking some water here. Ah, oh, somebody has four again. Gotta kill him. Gotta kill him. Gotta kill him. Or somebody else help me out and kill him. I, I love when Wax does that, the cow stuff. Am I going to be saying foul mouth all the time now? Because that sucks. Um, okay, let's try this again. Last time I played this level during Flag Rally, this leap. Where did that come from? Seriously. Just stop putting me there by the train tracks. Last time I played this level on Flag Rally, it had. Hey, a vacuum. Good. Let's see if I can do something here. God damn it. Stop putting me there! I hate when I keep getting respawned in the same area over and over and over again. Ser okay, seriously. The last time I played this level, since I was incredibly rusty on it, it took... No joke, like a half hour to beat. That was good thing I wasn't recording because somebody else has four now. I mean, ser seriously, the last time I did this before this recording took about a half hour to finish. And it's not what you think. It might be though, but every time. I got four flags, which happened at least seven or eight times. Somebody else has four. Kill him or her. I I seriously got four flags frequently, but every time I went on these train tracks here to go to the exit area, the fucking train came and just killed me. And that's just bullshit. But I'm pretty sure every time somebody gets four flags, the train passes through. Yeah, see? Somebody had four, and then there goes the train. But I feel like you can't even dodge the train going over that bridge. You, know, you might be able to, but... And that's not even the worst part. One time I did make it through. Well, never mind. I mean... A couple times I did make it past the train, but somebody was over there and decided to kill me in some way. Hey, I got four! And, oh, this might work nicely. No train, please. Thank you. And here's the exit. Oh, yeah, see, that was the worst part. Those rocks will create a massive rock slide and take your flag away. But, okay, that took way too long. But, we got her done. So, next time, Swamp Stomp Flag Relay. See ya.